The Earth has a magnetic field that is generated by the motion of molten iron in its outer core. This field has a complex structure, but it can be simplified by representing it as the sum of two components, the vertical component and the horizontal component. The vertical component of the Earth's magnetic field is directed downwards towards the magnetic south pole, and the horizontal component is directed towards the magnetic north pole. A compass needle is a magnet that has a north-seeking end and a south-seeking end. When it is free to rotate, it will align itself along the Earth's magnetic field lines. This means that the north-seeking end of the compass needle will point towards the magnetic north pole, which is located near the geographic north pole. However, the Earth's magnetic field is not perfectly aligned with the geographic north pole. The angle between the direction of the Earth's magnetic field and the direction of true north is called magnetic declination. Magnetic declination varies depending on where you are on the Earth's surface and can change over time. To use a compass for navigation, you need to adjust for magnetic declination. This involves determining the magnetic declination for your location and then compensating for it by adding or subtracting a certain number of degrees from your compass bearing. Overall, the reason why a compass needle always points towards the north is because it aligns itself along the Earth's magnetic field lines, which are directed towards the magnetic north pole. Subscribe to our channel. Amazing information about our mysterious world awaits you.